Hey Pingang! Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I will be cash stuffing the monetary graduation gifts that I received last June 24. So, I finally graduated in college, guys. And if you haven't watched my graduation vlog, I recently uploaded that in my YouTube channel. So, you can check it out and you can see what I did during my last days in the university. So yeah, as what I have said, I received monetary gifts, especially from my sister and from my family. So I will budget them today and use it wisely and put it in my budget binders. So before I start, I want to introduce to you guys my new binders that I bought online. So I changed my fabric binders into leather ones so i am just in love with these guys so they are so cute they are similar to my synthetic leather binders which i offer in my shop so i really wanted small ones because they are so cute guys they really look like wallets so this is my cash wallet and this is our couple binder so i will introduce them to you guys and i want you to see the new categories that I placed in here. So here in my cash wallet, which is what I bring every time I go out, do some errands. So I still have six Ziplocs in here, which is fun money, gas. So for this Ziploc, this is intended for our new motorcycle. Actually, it's not brand new because it's my sister's motorcycle. She gave it to me. She didn't say that it was a graduation gift, but I am still going to pay for the remaining balance of the installment of that motorcycle. So my boyfriend and I talked about it and we agreed on dividing the payment. Next month, he will be going home from his OJT. And I know that we will always use that motorcycle so it is essential to put a gas ziplock here so that we can pay for the gasoline while we do some errands and go on dates together. So yeah, I also placed here eating out because you know I always eat out when I go to the city. And I also place here transpo whenever I ride the jeepney or the tricycle. So I need transportation fare. And of course, I retained the groceries. And the last ziplock is for my receipts. So look at this guys. It's so cute. It has three card slots. It also has a slot here for maybe your IDs and also here. I placed here my PhilHealth ID and my vaccination card. And this is my national ID. And my debit card, my credit card, and my Maya card. So this is so cute, guys. I have been using this for a week now. This is my cash wallet, which is color pink. Next is this one. It's a white one. I decided to use this binder as our couple savings binder. So this one is for our savings for me and my boyfriend whenever we have dates or travels to go to. So we really wanted to save up for that together. So I just placed here four Ziplocs for now. First is our food date savings challenge. I will just shade the numbers here so that we can save up for our dates or when we want to eat out. So our goal here is 2,000 pesos. I laminated this one and just pasted it on the Ziploc. So next is our luxury savings challenge. This is for saving up to buy for something like if we want to buy some shoes or something to wear. So our goal here is 3,000 pesos. So we are going to divide that equally so that we can save up as a couple. So next is our anniversary savings challenge. So we just turned six years together last June 4. Now I thought of saving up for our next anniversary because we haven't been celebrating our anniversaries we are really saving up money for our future and divorce so our goal here is also three thousand pesos 
And our last savings challenge is the travel savings challenge. And my boyfriend and I are talking about traveling when he gets home next month. So we decided to save up for that travel. Our goal is 6,000 pesos. That's it for this binder. This is our savings challenge binder as a couple. And I also revamped my Sagrada Cafe binder. So as you can see, I just played with the facade of this binder. I made a Scrabble inspired cover. So I was really bored that time. So I just made these things which are related to budgeting like bills, um, monthly income, something like that. So yeah. This is a pink binder and I placed here my old label, the Sagrada Cafe label. I finally made our official labels for our cafe. So first one is for our cafe's bank account. So we haven't decided which bank account we will use or if we are going to open a new bank account for our cafe. But I have a spare one which is my Maya card. So I think we might use that or we might not. So whatever. Um, it depends. So next is our repairs. The cafe is still under construction. So I will put money in here later for our repairs. Next is for pantry. This is for our stocks of ingredients or food products that we are going to offer in the cafe. Next is for decor, of course, as a person who really loves decorating and designing. I love aesthetic things. So it's important for us to save up for the cafe's decorations. Next is for our furniture and equipment. So that's very important to start a business. Next is the internet. We really wanted to have Wi-Fi in the cafe so that the customers will also enjoy staying in our cafe and browse the internet. Next is our utility bills like the water bill and electric bill. So I just placed the labels in one Ziploc. Next is for salary. Once we open the cafe, we are not yet going to hire an employee. So this salary is intended for us. Maybe in the future when we are ready to hire some employees, we are going to work on that. Next is for taxes. Running a business has annual taxes, especially in renewing our business permits or if we need to pay something in the BIR. So I placed a Ziploc here for that. And last is my old Ziploc body budget. So I just placed it in here because this binder is for business purposes. And I still have one more Ziploc here. So that's an extra if I have another idea what kind of category I want to put in this binder. So yeah, that is basically the three binders. Let us proceed now in cash stuffing. I will just take out my cash. And I'm not going to count this anymore, guys, because I already uploaded a YouTube Shorts in my YouTube channel where I counted all of these cash. And the total here is 6,370 pesos. So I'm not going to count this anymore because the denominations are so many. So the 100s and 50s, these came from my sister. So I want to give a special shout out. She's living in Dubai and because I graduated, she was very generous to give me a graduation gift. So I'm very thankful for this one guys because it would really help me in adding money into my binders. So yeah. Let's start in budgeting. I have here my notepad where I already placed 
the amounts that I'm going to put in my binders. So first, I am going to start with my cash wallet, which is my pink A7 binder over here. And let's see. For fun money, I am going to put 100 pesos. So how are you guys? I hope you are all doing well. We are already halfway through the year. And literally, time passes so fast. But that's what I like because next month, I will finally meet my boyfriend again. We have so many plans to do because as what I have said earlier, we haven't celebrated our important events or dates, especially our anniversary and birthdays because he is very far away from me. So we just talk with each other online through messenger. So yeah, for gas, I'm not going to put anything for now because I'm not yet using the motorcycle. I don't know how to drive. Actually, I know how to drive the motorcycle, but I am a very anxious person. And I really get nervous when I drive down the road. So, it scares me a lot. So, my boyfriend will drive the motorcycle when he gets home. Next is eating out. I'm also going to put 200 pesos. Okay, for eating out. So, the feeling, guys, is very weird. I finally graduated and today I'm budgeting as an unemployed person. So, I'm officially unemployed. Next is my transportation. Let's put 40 pesos in here. And last is our groceries. I'm going to put 100. Okay, I'm done with this one. Next is... I'll just put some money in here in our couple savings binder. So I want to start saving up for our savings challenges. So since this is laminated, I'm going to use this marker slash highlighter that I used in my bank teller slip here. So yeah, for our food date savings challenge, I'm going to put 100 pesos for now. So here. Next is our Luxury Savings Challenge. I'm going to put 250. Hmm. One, two, 50. So that's 250. The cash is very new, guys. Look at that. It's very crisp. So it's a waste to fold the cash, but... I have no choice this binder is very small so I really need to fold my cash next is our anniversary savings challenge I am going to put 200 pesos I'll just hmm I'll just put this one okay we have 200 I'm starting to like the color white guys color pink and white is very minimalist and very clean for me that's why I love these colors next is my travel savings challenge I'm going to put 500 pesos that's one two three four five hundred Look at that. It's so new, guys. Oh my gosh. So, this were the money that I got from my money bouquet last Saturday when I graduated. 
So if you haven't seen my photos I posted in my Instagram account, guys, about my graduation photos. So if you want to see that, follow me on Instagram. Next is our sinking funds binder. For my sinking funds, um, let me count my savings. So this is my savings in the bank. I still have 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000 pesos. So I won't add anything in here for now. And my boyfriend's savings, he already has 10,000, 20, 30, 40,000, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5. So he saved up 45,000 pesos already. So I think he has 5,000 pesos cash on hand. Congratulations to my boyfriend. He finally saved his goal, which is 50,000 pesos. So that's amazing that's like my savings for two years before when i was having a hard time saving up because i am a very impulsive buyer before so for my birthday fund i'm going to put 100 so let's use the 50 peso bills now because i have many 50 peso bills i had 53 pieces of 50 peso bills Oh my gosh, I have many denominations today. So for my birthday fund, I have 500, 700, 800, 950, 1,000 pesos. So my birthday is still in January, so it's um, a bit far from this month. So next is our grab -a scooter. So this was the motorcycle that I was mentioning a while ago. I already paid for um, the June bill. So next one is for July. And we need to save up 4,000 pesos for that. But for now, for my contribution, I'm going to put 2,000. And the rest of the 2,000 pesos will be for my boyfriend. So I'm going to put 2,000 pesos. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So for Gravis Scooter, I should have 2,000 pesos. 100, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1,000. 100, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 50, 850, 950, 2,000 pesos. So that's it for this scooter. Oh my gosh. It's very hard to put in the Ziplocs because they are very new. Get inside. Okay. It's very bulky. Alright. Next is emergency. I'm going to put 100 pesos also. Now I have 200, 350, 400 pesos. For Happy Meal, I placed a credit card ziplock here because I received my credit card from BDO. If there's an instance that I will use that credit card, I'll put the payment here. Next is my parents Ziploc. I am going to put 500 pesos. So this is my contribution for our electric bill. Our electric bill increased guys because we have been using the air conditioner every day. Because the weather here in the Philippines was very hot. Since it has been raining for a few weeks now, we don't need to use the aircon anymore because Burr months is fast approaching. So next is my Sagrada Cafe binder. I'm going to put something in the repairs Ziploc only. So let's put 100 pesos. Now we have 150, 250, 350, 450, 
500 pesos. Okay. And we are done with this one. And next is my long-term savings binder. We are going to stuff health with 100 pesos. Now I have 100, 2, 3, 50, 400 pesos. Next is for my vacation fund. I am going to put 150. And now I have 200, 300, 400, 500, 650, 750, 850, 950, 1,000 pesos. And last is for Christmas, I am going to put 50 pesos. So I'm not going to stuff the remaining Ziplocs because... My budget today is limited. So for Christmas, I have 100, 250, 300 pesos. I still have six months for Christmas, but I only managed to save 300 pesos for now. But yeah, um, my long-term savings binder is not my priority for now. But eventually, my funds will increase in here. Um, in the future next and last is my savings challenges binder Hmm, let me start with my 100 envelopes challenge and I'm going to put 250 peso bills I got 45 and 32 so I'm going to put 50 pesos each there 45 and 32 and let's put it back in my basket that's 45 and 32 okay we are done with my 100 envelopes challenge next is my 20 peso savings challenge so this is a new card because I completed the challenge last time so i laminated this one already and i'm going to put 80 pesos 2468 let's put it inside and i'm just going to cross out for 20 pesos there okay For my 50 peso savings challenge, I am going to put 100 pesos. Let's cross out two circles. Next is my 100 peso savings challenge. I'm also going to put 100. Let's cross out one circle. Next is my roll the dice challenge. I am going to put 50 pesos only. So now I have 550, 70, 90, 610. We have 610. And I am going to shade this one and a four. There. Next. 
next is my buy it savings challenge for a tablet so my money in here is very thick now guys i don't know if it will fit inside this ziploc if i add more money but hopefully it will fit so i'm going to check another ticket which is 350 pesos Fifty one, fifty two, fifty three, fifty. Okay. So for our tablet fund, I now have five hundred, one thousand, five hundred, two thousand, two hundred, four hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred, nine hundred, three thousand, one hundred, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, four thousand. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 50. That's 4,550 pesos. So, this one's very thick, guys. Look at that. I hope it will fit inside. And yes, it does. Okay. Let's put back the card also there next is my refrigerator fund i'm going to put 1000 pesos oh my gosh it's all 50 peso bills let me count this 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 50 1000 so I hope this will also fit inside. Let's check another ticket, which is 1,000 pesos. And now for our fridge fund, I have 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000 in the bank, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, 9,000, 10,000, 500, 11,500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 12,000, 50, 150, 250, 350, 450, 550, 650, 750, 750, 750, 850, 950, 13,000 pesos. I hope it also fits in here. Let's push that inside okay so i'm done i will stuff my 2023 challenge in july so we have a few more days to go this binder became heavy so i'm done with my cash stuffing for today's vlog so i also want to thank my sister's boyfriend he gifted me this cute notebook which I can use to write on. So it's also a graduation gift from him. So if you like this video, don't forget to comment down below and also share this video so that we can inspire more people to try the cash envelope system and hopefully it will help them to live a financially sustainable life. So once again, thank you so much for watching guys and I will see you in my next one. Bye!